So the plan is to replace this shelf with a two by 12 by 11 ish feet. And then we'll have four brackets going down the middle. So the first thing we need to do is take this down. Uh, so I'm gonna do is first take off all these tops and then I'll take out these bottoms. And you see how that is kind of wedged? So when the nail goes in, it spreads it out. So when you take these out, the nail, you can actually pull it out and it does little or less damage to the drywall. Okay, so I'm getting ready to install the brackets now. After I spackled, painted, sanded, and got the walls all prepped, um, I'm gonna measure down kind of where my shelf was before. My shelf before was about 39 and a half inches down from the ceiling. So measuring this, the bracket, with a scrap piece of wood to see exactly where the top of my uh, shelf would be, I'm going to drill my first hole or top hole here uh, 40 and a half inches down from the ceiling and that works out perfect and then I'll go ahead and do that for the rest of them. Um, first I'll look for the stud as well so I'll have my stud finder and I'll take it and go through and I know I have a stud right here that spans from here to there. So what I did here is I laid the old shelf, wire shelf on top of this. I know this fit in there with a couple spaces on the end. So if I put this in and add seven eighths, it should fit in my uh, space exactly. So that's what I'll do. I measured it down to the bottom, squared it off, clamped it, and then if I come down here and measure it off seven eighths off the tip of this wire rack, we should be perfect. Now comes the fun part of sanding this down. Uh, so I'm gonna start with an 80 grit and then work my way up to 180, which should be good enough. And then I'll take a fine sandpaper and finish it off by hand. Then I'll put some uh, pre-stain on it, stain it to match the other wood in the laundry room, and then we should be in good shape and we'll go. The clip you see playing above is me taking my router and routing out a channel where my bracket's gonna sit. Because this is gonna be in my laundry room and most of the time I'll be looking up from the dryer to see the bottom of the shelf, I wanted to bring down the shelf even with all the brackets. Okay, now that I have the shelf in with the brackets, you can see how I notched out the wood here so the brackets will sit flush. And now what I'll do is I'll secure the screws in on each of the brackets.
there you have it, the shelf is done. The, these brackets are rated for 350 pounds, so we should have no problem putting our uh, miscellaneous laundry and stuff up here.